The Doherty County Board of Education's Finance Committee met this morning to discuss the distribution of funds for the upcoming school year. Fox 31 Sean Stryker was at that meeting to get a closer look at next year's budget. Planning for the 2012-2013 Doherty County Board of Education budget is underway. Due to the slow economy, the school district's financial committee already knows next year's local and state revenue will fall $14.5 million short of what was expected. This means cuts to spending must be made. We have a class with uh, 12 and another class with uh, 13. Our minimum class size may be, our maximum class size rather, may be 30. So we can collapse two classes and still be on our maximum class size, but we're being more efficient and needing less staff to do the same job. Eliminating classes does not transfer into eliminating staff. The school has a number of open positions, so instead of filling those vacancies, they would condense classes that are under the maximum class size, reducing the number of classes and new teachers needed. Being able to reduce the budget without making major cuts to the school faculty is always a good thing. However, the concern still remains on how it will affect the children. Well, we're never happy about having to cut programs, um, but uh, there's some tough decisions that have to be made, and uh, we try to make them on the basis of having the least impact on the children in our system. The school district is trying their best to keep programs such as art and gym in schools, and as of now, they are not planning on cutting those programs. They are, however, talking about reducing programs that aren't currently in every school, such as foreign languages. They would do this by compressing the curriculum into one state-funded location. Sean Stryker, Fox 31 News.